Hi, hello, my name is Elef and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Before we do anything, please make sure to go and like this video and subscribe to my channel. This whole setup took me about an hour and a half and I haven't even started filming the video yet. So please, go into some love. Now today's clothes are very, very random, as in I didn't really have a reason why I got them, I just liked them. Some of them were gifted to me by brands. I'm also slowly starting to prepare for summer holidays. So there's a lot of pieces that are like short sleeve, but I really cannot wear at the moment. So they're just gonna be sitting in my wardrobe for a while. But we have quite a few things to go through. So let's just get straight on with the video. So the first item is the one that I'm wearing right now. And this is a polo from ASOS. I really like the color of it. It just felt very summery. Although I've sworn that I'm never gonna wear a v-neck, I kind of liked it here. I like the how it folds into together. And yeah, it's just kind of a bit interesting. Now I got it to pair it up with this suit, which is also from ASOS. This is a linen striped suit. And I mean, hello, it screams summer. I absolutely love the stripes. I've always worn a striped suit. I could totally see myself wearing it at a wedding or like in a summer event. And to complete the look, I also got this pair of blackless loafers, also from ASOS, something that I've been wanting to have for so many years now. I felt like they complemented the look perfectly. I got to wear them once out in London and they are so, so, so comfortable. I ne Again, I never thought I would wear something like that outside London, but being in fashion now for the past two years, I'm opening up to new ideas and I'm kind of loving it. Also, they're like 20 pounds and they look so much like the Gucci ones. I'm gonna have them linked along with everything else in this rack on the description below. So if you see anything that you like, go and check it out. Moving on, since we are in the ASOS part of the haul, I might as well show you the last thing that I got from there. It is this Harrington jacket, which I really like the design of it. I love the color yellow. I have so many pieces in my wardrobe that are yellow. And I just felt like this is something that I could totally wear on a festival if I'm going, because I have not booked anything yet. I feel like this is such an easy piece to get with you on a holiday or even better during festival season. Like with a white t-shirt, it completely elevates the look. I've kind of worn it similar like that on my Instagram. Again, most of this stuff, probably there are already pictures on my Instagram. So make sure to head there to see how I've styled them. I'm gonna link my Instagram in the description below. Okay. Next up, I'm gonna show you some pieces that I got for Calvin Klein. Now, I usually go to Calvin Klein website every two, three months because they do have some very cool pieces and that I usually wanna show on my Instagram. And oh boy, was I in luck this time because I found a very, very, very cool jean that I'm so glad I ran into because Look at that. It has patches all over and I'm low-key obsessed with it. Now, the moment I saw this, I instantly know that I had to go into my card. It has this very street style vibe, which I'm really into at the moment. As I'm evolving, I feel like this is kind of more into what I would want to grow as a channel and as like personal style. I love the way it fits. It's light denim, so it's perfect for summer. Like, their jeans are such good quality that can never really say anything bad about them. But let me show you what I go to style them with. So, I got a bucket hat to go with a pair of jeans. And I know what you're thinking. Really, I left a bucket hat. But let me tell you what. I was not a big fan of bucket hats. I'm still not convinced. I think they take street style into the next new level. A level that I'm not very comfortable to go there yet. I feel like my style is still very preppy street style if you can even define yourself like that. But I don't know what it is about this bucket hat. The color, the fit, maybe the fact that it goes perfectly with a pair of jeans, which probably that's what it is. But I love it. To be honest, I was not planning on keeping it. I was planning on returning it. But after wearing it, like I feel like it sits so well with me that yeah, I'm gonna rock it during summer. So bring it on. Now wrapping up my Calvin Klein order, I went for this metallic set, which is part of the Andy Warhol and Calvin Klein collection. Now, every time I shop online, I always go for a wild card. Something that I normally wouldn't check out when I'm in store, try it on, let alone buy it. It's part of my experimenting process, evolving my personal style, trying not to wear boring clothes, says the guy with a polo and a grey trousers. But you know what I mean. Now, this is definitely not an everyday piece, but frankly, I'm not mad of the way it looks. I think I'm gonna keep it for maybe like a sorties event or when I'm trying to like fit in on a cool crowd. But I actually found the perfect pants to go with this. And they are from weekday. Now there are these contract 
they are this contrast stitch. They are these contrast stitch chinos, and I think it was uh, this time last year that contrast stitch was so popular in stores. I remember I had this uh, shirt from Top One that I used to wear all the time, but I kind of ran into them in the weekly store the other day, and the love just came right back in. They have this work well feel in them, and their straight leg, which I'm so into right now, huge, huge plus. I'm so over the skinny jeans thread, they never look good on me, so can't stress this enough, find fits that you feel comfortable in and that you think you look good at. So last few pieces I have from Friends Connection and Topman. I'm gonna start with Topman because there's literally just one shirt along with this vest which I got to go with this shirt but okay so I'm a big guy right? You would think a small would fit me quite nicely but surprisingly this is so huge on me and it just sits so horribly that it makes me feel so much worse about myself. Wow, that was a lot of sewing in one sentence. So you can imagine how mad I am about this. It's also like 10 pounds, so you would think that they have like a good quality or at least the fit is somewhat nice. Well, I absolutely hate this. I would never buy it again. I'm on the lookout for a better vest, but for now, as I said, that I was only looking to wear it under this shirt just so I can add like a layering element into my outfits. And yeah, it works fine with that. This shirt, is stunning i absolutely love this one it's about 30 pounds it's from topman it's quite expensive but you know what for summer i'm all about fun prints colors and just completely different from what you would expect me to wear if you know me like for my winter fashion winter i'm all about simplicity i put a lot of thought into my layering there but summer i just want to be bold i want to have fun i'm going for crazy prints Crazy Harrington jackets, as I mentioned before. So I saw this shirt and I knew it had to be my first short sleeve shirt of the summer. I love the colors, I love the palm. Like, it's just so beautiful. Again, I don't really think that this is something that I could wear potentially in London, but this baby is surely going into my luggage whenever I'm going on holiday in Brighton maybe, or even back to Greece. Last but not least, we have Friends Connection. And I am gonna start with my favorite piece, and it, you may recognize it if you follow me on Instagram. And that is this pair of trousers. Now, I've been wearing this one on the blue version throughout the whole winter. I wore them during Fashion Week, I wore them to so many events. Anytime that I really wanted to just vamp my look with like a fun trouser, I would go for this pair because not only fits me perfectly it has again a straight leg which i love but the fact that it has these two pockets are so perfect for my body structure because i do have quite wide big i have big i have big big thighs and these two huge um pockets hide them perfectly and they make me look more proportionate and skinny which is always good. The blue version of this is literally my favorite pair of trousers that I own. And I'm so glad that they have them in this light gray as well. And yeah, it just feels more appropriate for summer. I really cannot wear it. The color feels a lot more appropriate for summer. And yeah, I'm definitely gonna be wearing these a lot. Next up is this sweatshirt. A very simple sweatshirt, it's just striped. I feel like it's just perfect for the season. I mentioned at the beginning of the video that I'm always having trouble knowing what to wear around this time of the year. And I feel like this just solves all my problems because it is striped, so it has that summery feel, but then it's long sleeve, so you can wear it during this time of the season where it's not that warm, that the nights are still pretty chilly. Just a great option for everyday look. Put this on, pair of jeans, a white sneaker, and you're off to go. Not really too much thought into the look. And it just works. Last but not least, I have this Friends Connection number right here, and that is a baby blue shirt, which, to be honest, the only reason why I got this is because it reminds me so much of the 90s fashion, and particularly Chandler Bing style. I've been watching, I've been re-watching Friends, and I actually never realized how fashionable Chandler is. I saw this shirt on the website and I thought that I had to get it. It kind of has like a thick layering near the buttons and then as you go towards the outside of it, it's like see-through. So you also get that Charlie Sin vibe, which is also very vintagey and 
again, obsessed with it. You can do so many things with it, and that's what I love about Friends Connection. They have the really simple pieces that you can like play around, super versatile, you can really build up an outfit with them. And then they have the standout pieces like the trousers that I just showed you. And yeah, that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Everything that I mentioned will be linked in the description below because all of these pieces are quite new. But before you leave, make sure to like this video and subscribe to my channel. Leave a comment below and let me know your thoughts on these pieces and I'll see you guys soon. Bye bye.